Hello, my name is Hal and I'm from Chrono Spark Power Systems. I'm here today to talk about parasitic loads, what they are, and how they affect your battery uh, reserve time in your vehicle. So what a parasitic load is, is any device in your vehicle that is drawing power when the key is off. Um, so for example, most modern cars will have several devices in them that cause parasitic loads. Older vehicles, they just run a point ignition, a carburetor, uh, maybe a clock will be the only thing that will draw power when the vehicle is off. So what we're going to do is put a current meter in line with the battery to measure the amount of draw that the car has on the battery. So one thing to note before you do this, uh, because a lot of current meters have limits on how much current they can pass through them, uh, is to make sure all your doors are closed, the vehicle key, the key is out of the ignition, all the things that will cause the vehicle to draw a lot of current from the battery. Uh, you want to make sure your dome lights are off, things like that. So in this case, we have one of our micro batteries here installed in this Nissan 350Z. Uh, we have a current meter, uh, just an inline current meter that measures milliamps. We're going to take and disconnect the, the battery and hook up the current meter to it, to the, uh, to the battery terminal, and then take the other side of the current meter to the battery. And we see here on the current meter, we have a draw of 206 milliamps. This is not atypical for a modern car. They will usually have a fairly high parasitic load as soon as you hook the battery up, but it will drop down to a lower value, usually within 10 or 15 seconds. This car starts at 200, then drops down to 60 after about 15 seconds, or, or less, down to 65 now, and then after about 20 minutes, it drops to 12 milliamps. So if you want to calculate how long your micro battery, which is a one amp hour, capacity battery can be left sitting in the vehicle before you have to start it or recharge it, you can take the parasitic load of the vehicle, in this case 12 milliamps, and divide the amp hour capacity by the parasitic load. So we have a 1 amp hour capacity battery uh, divided by 0 0.012 amps of the parasitic load, and you get about, about 80 hours. Uh, so in this case, you wouldn't want to leave this vehicle sitting for more than maybe two days, maybe you go three comfortably and still start okay, but you, I would say no more than two days uh, and you still have plenty of reserve capacity to start your vehicle uh, and recharge the battery.